What a shock announcement. Lipitegia has been fired as the Spanish national team head coach one day before the World Cup starts. Two days before the World Cup starts, he was announced Real Madrid manager to take over after the World Cup, meaning Lopetegui will be leading um, you know, the Spanish confederation, leading the Spanish teams, leading in yes, the last World Cup, you know, all these players to World Cup glory. Then he will be able to take over the Real Madrid job for Zinedine Zidane, who have stepped down, you know, after winning three Champions League in a row. But now news have came out that Lopetegui has been fired by the Spanish Football Confederation, which is a shock news. But at the same time, we look. You gotta look at it from two point of views. Days before the World Cup, a tournament that the Spanish teams will look to revive themselves, flying under the radar, not starting to pick up steams as everybody seems to catch on that the Spanish teams have took and basically complete a transition by bringing in, you know, mixing in the old with the new players like Koke, players like Saul, you know, Rodrigo, all these players that would have not have been part of the Spanish team to be part of the team under Lopetegui after Del Bosque have stepped down. But days before the World Cup starts, you announced that and Real Madrid have came out. Remember, there are two different things. There will report that the Real Madrid and the Spanish Confederation team, you know, Confederation, Football Confederation had an agreement, but it don't look like it was an agreement because the day before the World Cup, the players, you know, years of preparation with one man at the helm, you know, years of trust building with the players that he have coached since they were young kids. And now all of a sudden you're telling these players that this is not going to be your coach. And now you're forced to find who's going to be the next coach going into the World Cup. You got 24 hours to announce that. And I think that's a big, big problem because the confederation probably take that as a classless act for Real Madrid to announce the, you know, that Libertad will be taking over after the World Cup. That was an announcement that should have been waited until the World Cup was done or until Spain got not at the World Cup. But due to the fact that the ball wasn't kicked yet and Lopetegui has taken a step forward to allow Real Madrid to tell the world that he would be the coach right after the World Cup, I think they didn't sit well with the Spanish national team. So with all they have been said, man, the World Cup is coming up tomorrow, first game, Saudi Arabia versus Russia. And this is all crazy, man. This is all fun and games. Still somebody get knocked out of the World Cup. And all, oh, you know, oh man, what do you guys think, man? What do you guys think? Lopetegui will be great at Real Madrid, but the move to announce the move before making the move was a dumb move. But if you're new to the channel, make that move over to that bell button. Definitely don't forget to subscribe. Hit that bell button. <laughs> wow, that was crazy. That was crazy. Do you guys think that it was right for the Spanish Confederation to fire him because your amateur announced the news too early? Or you guys think that was a disgrace? He should have let finish the job. Even the news was out that he would be leaving the Confederation and taking over at Real Madrid for Zizou. Let me know in the comment section down below.